Good morning, skiers and riders. Sugarloaf and Carabasset Valley. Hope you're ready for a great day enjoying the outdoors. Time for your latest local forecast and some info to know before you go. Brought to you by Village to Go. Check them out in Village West. And you can find this and much more on all your internet devices at our website, WSKITV.com. Partly sunny skies today, partly to mostly sunny skies, especially this morning. 15 to 19 for your summer temperatures, 25 to 29 for your base temperatures with a light north-northwest breeze across the hill from the summit down to the base. So not anything to worry about. Uh, and milder out there uh, than the last couple of days. So get out there and enjoy it. It should be a great day. Uh, enjoying the skiing and riding snow showers for wednesday could see an inch or two of accumulation through thursday morning or so high temperatures at the summit around 19 degrees base temperatures topping out in the lower 30s and that south breeze barely noticeable out there so get out there and enjoy it for main day on wednesday chances some snow showers on thursday we'll see a high of 29 and then we'll see temperatures start to drop and the skies start to clear out so you can see partly sunny skies for friday and saturday uh, below zero up towards the summit in the teens down here around the base, so it'll be a weekend to bundle up. Tuesday, January 26th, Birchwood Interiors brings you your trail report. 95 trails of ski and ride on, 9 lifts skinny of those runs, 55 trails on the groomers list. We're looking at hard pack, pack powder surfaces, and be aware gauge will be closed for most of the day for racing from pick pole down to PV. Central Mountain Grooming last night, Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, Hayburner, King's Landing, the east side of Skidder, Narrow Gauge, Competition Hill, Spillway and Sluice, Gondola Line. They were going to try and get the extension as well. White Nitro from Spillway Crosscut down. They'll do Olive Wedge, Haywire, Candy Side, Lower Winters Way, and all the trails around the base area. And the East Mountain Trails that got groomed out are Hallback, Choker, Flume, Widowmaker, and Ramdown. Lower on the east side, Two Hall, Wiffle Tree, Slasher, and Rollway. Over on the west side, you'll find fresh stripes on Scoot, Windrow, as well as the stomping grounds and boardwalk terrain parks, and uh, snowmaking fires back up today on Sluice Headwall, Drop Line, as well as Candy Side. Snubber, Skidway, and Sawduster, those get going at 8.30. There's a possibility we may see one of those lifts not run today, but you'll still be able to get to all the terrain. Uh, Super Quad, Skyline, Double Runner East, those get going at 8.30 this morning. Double Runner East gets you up to the top or the bottom of the Skyline Quad. Super Quad and Skyline get you pretty much anywhere you need to go. Over on the east side, you'll find King Pine and Wiffle Tree. And those, uh, King Pine, get you to some nice expert terrain. Wiffle Tree, some intermediate terrain. And Timberline, the uppermost lift here on the mountain, should be good to go to run today with some great views as well as great grooming off of the extensions. Uh, Cross-country skiing down at the Sugarloaf Outdoor Center. Everything is groomed. The ice rink is open. Snowshoeing is good. Fat biking is great. The outdoor, uh, the Bull Moose Bakery and Cafe is delicious, so go down there and enjoy the outdoor center. The fat bike trail conditions off the narrow gauge pathway are all in good shape. And if you want to do some indoor activity, check out the anti-gravity complex. Also want to make note that I did notice a snowmobile groomer grooming the uh, narrow gauge pathway. is headed north this morning, so that should be in good shape. Uh, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. That's where you'll find us hanging out on social media. You'll also find us on WSKITV.com. That's our website with this latest local forecast. Tons of videos of things to do and info to know before you go, as well as our live quad cam shots so you can see exactly what's happening at the base of the mountain in real time. And check out this survey, Resort tvresearch.com slash survey for your chance to win a custom built Carver titanium obese mountain bike by uh, from our friends at Carver Bikes as well as outside television. Be sure to go and fill out that survey. Have a great day folks. Continue to be safe.